siasa wale wanapanga na kujipangia siasa za 2027 waendelee na hatuna shida na wao wale wanataka kwenda kutafuta na tembea na wajakoya na kalonzo wafanye urafiki nao ni haki yao ya kikatiba hata yule anataka kutengeneza chama ya siasa atengeneze lakini usiwe wewe una sabotage kazi ya serikali ati ili utumie hiyo siasa kurudi kuambia watu ati oh Mount Kenya barabara haziundwi sasa leo siju utasema nini hii ni police station inaje, imejengwa ikaisha sisi na sisi tumetengeneza urafiki na William Ruto na serikali ambayo tuliunda pamoja hii serikali tujiulize tutaitumiaje ili maendeleo na mambo ya kustawisha nchi ifikie wananchi ambao wanatupigia kura ili 2027 ikifika hiyo wanasema hatutakuja kuwapea story tutakuja tuwahesabie barabara ilikuwa imekwama imefunguliwa inaendelea waziri hapa Kiambu ndio bedroom ya Nairobi ukiona tukinena Kiswahili hapa sio ati sababu hatuelewi na hatujui Kikuyu lakini tunajua tumechanganyika watu wa jamii zote za Kenya and that is the beauty of our county ukisikia tukisema hatutaki kuchanganyishwa kwa siasa za ukabila sababu tunaelewa wale wapiga kura wanapigia kawanjiko kura hapa Kiamba ni wa jamii zote za Kenya na najua kuna watu kutoka Luo Nyanza kuna watu kutoka Kisi kuna watu kutoka Western kuna watu kutoka Rift Valley hata watu wa coast wameishi kwa amani na wakenya wengine hapa kiamba kama ndugu na dada na ndio tumesema tusigawe kwa misingi ya ukabila sababu ya siasa lakini pia usitutumie sisi kama ngao ya kujikinga kwa siasa za ukabila useme utatumia jamii moja ili umobilize jamii na mambo ya siasa ambayo ni ya kujinufaisha we mtu binafsi Waziri what we want you to focus on is unlocking all our development projects not just in Kiambu County and in the Mount Kenya region assist the president to unlock development projects that will give value to the Kenyan people give value to the votes that the Kenyan people voted for the Kenya Kwanza government and join us in uniting all the people of our country irrespective of the language they speak or where they came from originally because wherever we live it is god who has chosen for us where to live hakuna mtu uambiwa ati lazima uishi hapa mungu ndiye hukuelekeza uishi na wakenya wengine mahala popote kenya hii na dunia hii because when we look at you we have seen a leader who is focused and a leader who will not be mixed up in the current day politics where people want to mobilize on the basis of ethnicity for their own selfish and parochial interests we want you waziri to focus on unlocking all our development projects 